What's up, man? Great game. So thank you guys. Appreciate you guys. Definitely the, the most creative game plan you guys have come to a game with this season. I mean, as you look at your performance, what can you say about your offense out there? Yeah, you know, I think uh, that game, that was a grinder kind of game. It was a tough game, you know, even, you know, 27 to three, it was, it was a lot tougher than 27 to three. They did a great job, um, bring some some different pressures. But as far as the game plan, you know, I just think uh, Coach Plow was just thinking of creative ways to run the ball and just kind of get it going. So um, credit to him. And I know we ask about Khalil every week, but I mean, is there anything he can't do? He carried the ball today. He made that amazing catch on the sideline. I mean, does he does he just impress you every game? I mean, does he impress you every game? I mean, Absolutely. Yeah. I mean, it's. I don't know. I was I was telling someone earlier. I was like, geez, like, I don't I'm, I'm like I don't want to take anything away from it, but it's just Khalil. Like when he makes a play like that, you just it's it's normal. So it's not normal, but it's I've seen it so many times now. It's normal. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thank you. Hank, you know, being one and two, I mean, I, a lot of guys were saying all week, hey, you know, we're six points from being three and oh, but uh, you know, what, just to start conference playoff with a win, some tough games coming up. This is obviously a big game to, to win this one, get to one and oh in league, you know, get back to 500. How, how big was a win like this? I think it was huge for us. I think it was huge for us offensively. Um, the defense has been doing a great job and uh, they did a great job turning the ball over today. I don't know, two or three or however many they had. Um, did a great job just giving us the ball in great field position and, um, it, it was just a huge win for us, I think, that first win in conference. So um, I'm fired up for Coach Av, you know, get another win and um, just keep it rolling. There's been a lot of talk, obviously, of the, the struggles in the third quarter and the second half, you know, in your losses. But you guys had eight third downs in the third quarter, were able to move the ball some. And, you know, you win the second half scoring 17 to three. How, how big was uh, finishing an emphasis in this one? I mean, it was, it's been big. You know, I think, um, you know, it's something – we're obviously self-critical of, we take self-accountability on and um, Coach Av has done a great job, Coach Blau, Coach D of, of just reminded us of, of how big it is and how, how big we have to execute and finish, you know, because I think as far as an offense, we're, we've been playing out of our mind in the, in the first half and then we just have to come out and we have to finish and we have to execute, start fast first and out of that third quarter. Thanks, Hank. Thank you. What's up, Hank? How you doing? You good, how are you? All right. Um, Hank, are you going to have to uh, go get a new set of cleats after this? It, it might have burned all the rubber off the bottom, keeping them on those those option plays. How, how important is that going to be to helping the rest of the run game? Yeah, you know, uh, we were just up late last night watching some clips of Usain Bolt, so um, I don't know if I <laughs> – uh, yeah, I, I think it just within this game plan um, – they, they, they uh, crashed hard, so as far as the game plan is on read, um, just something to do to keep them honest. And um, I don't know how many yards we had them doing it or whatever, but um, I felt like it, it just kind of helped us out, helped, helped us move the sticks a little bit. So if we can just keep doing it, I think it would be great. Um, from the first time you ran the play in practice until you saw Big 99 standing with the football in the end zone today, uh, how cool is it when, when Scott Matlock contributes on offense and Andy was saying there was one point in time where he, he dropped that pass, but he's been pretty solid ever since that practice. Yeah, I mean, uh, that guy touched on it. I'm fired up for Scotty, you know. He does everything right. Um, he's always in on that package and goal line. Um, he, he's in there annihilating guys um, on that on that specific play. And uh, Coach Paul made a great call um, doing the play action off of it. And we run it every single day. So um, Scotty's gotten better at, at catching it. And um, – no, I hope, you know, he would have caught it because he was wide open. You know, I would have, you know, give, give him something for the rest of his life. But, uh, you know, he made a great play, and uh, he deserves it for sure. Congrats, Hank. Thank you. Will, Will and Rachel. Sorry, multitasking. Hey, Hank, uh, Coach Avalos talked about this week being your guys' best week of prep leading up to today's game. What did you see in practice that gave you guys confidence today? I think it's just our ability to execute. You know, um, you know, sometimes practice can run over as far as the time, you know, maybe making a mistake on a play and having to reload it, you know, something along those lines. We actually finished a couple of practices early this week, so I, I've never really seen that. Um, as far as far as finishing practice early, just our ability to get through the script and um, get through our periods really well. Um, it's because we're efficient and we are executing. So I think it was a big thing for us, and uh, hopefully we can continue uh, doing that coming forward. Thanks, Hank. Thank you.
Hey, we got to see a true freshman in at quarterback briefly. Uh, you know, what did you think of Green's performance and, and how is he coming along and, and could we see him more? <laughs> that was a lot of questions in one, but. <laughs> yeah. uh, Tay's my guy. Talon's my guy. Um, I love that kid. He, he, he's such a great kid. Um, and for him to get out there and experience that, uh, yeah, he took a little pound. I think he, he had like six guys tackle him. So he got a little taste. Um, and I, I'm just really happy for him. And he's going to be a great player moving forward. He's a, he's a freak. And um, I'm sure we'll see him in some packages moving forward. Thank you. All right. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Hank. All right. Thank you. Yep. Recording stopped. Thank you, guys. Appreciate you guys.